Hey guys, welcome to this confusing level. It's quite hard to drop rocks and find all the keys, and I had to draw a diagram to help Sphere. I had to take notes. First thing I do is do down the ladder and I take damage, but it's hard to grab them from the top. So I just jump. Now I go into the little structure and spin the well to drop another rock like I did in Perduo's level. You have to drop two rocks in this level to progress and find all the traps of Aegis Key and Jupiter. Do it right the first time. Or you get to the boss level and find out you have to go back and search for whatever you missed. You know, actually, I prefer the green of the marsh to all this brown. And where are the mosquitoes? Buzz, buzz! That was a classic enemy. Okay, come on, Mickey Boy, let's take care of this rock for Greek justice. You have no chance to survive, make your time. Well, it's kind of weird that the rock doesn't make any noise when it hits the ground. Another flaw for the katana, but it's still better than Superman 64. Okay, now I go back to the other side of where the rock fell. In my notes, I call this the rock cage. It leads to many cliffs. I climb to the top of the pots. I'm Casey Casey when these hits just keep on coming. Moving up the charts. This level is actually pretty simple. It's just large and overwhelming at first. In the first sec point, you drop rock shit clears the way for a path to Aegis Keys and an exit in the next stage is the battle with Sergius. He is a three-headed dog with three heads and he's like a mini boss. But the real boss of this exit point is Medusa, which we will see in the next levels. I'm not sure to call them levels or sections or parts or what. Technically this is all part of the same Acropolis level, but it's split into many different maps. Just like Half-Life. Half-Life owes all of its succeeds to Decatana, and Valve is a cheap copycat, if you ask me. Oh, and Yuri, I drop a new rock, and this is part where the game plays a pretty trick on you. Okay, there's some enemies, that's fine, but watch the cheap descent boy Decatana tries to pull the wool over your eyes, but I'm not having that, good sir. There is a hidden wheel in the darkness here. It's in total darkness and you need to use it to get past, so why is it hidden? This crap had me scooped for a night time, day Katana, you tricky bitch. That's poor level design, if you ask me. Well, no use crying over. Smile, milk, I forgive you, day Katana, but I've got my eye in you. Time for some healing time now, I think. This level is so long and hard I need to keep my stern eggs up. Hero Kikio must be really dehydrated and get some water helps them out so much. They're going to get sick if they don't drink stealthy of waitar. And why does Kikio drink the waitar by running into it? She has a drinking Problem. Ah ha ha ha, that's a classic joke from Airplane. Okay, now this first sec point is done. I go back to the ladder form the beginning, then I make my move. It's a complicated maneuver, but my notes will help me on read. Okay, it just say go back to ladder at start. Wow, I suck at asking notes. I think there is a door here to go back to ladder. Somewhere around here. Take a tan, I really needed a map system. Okay, recite tent roar. It can. Climb the ladder and get some more preps of the key. The last preps. You will see why say need all these in the next level. Quick side, where we fight Sergius, the nightmare monster. 
Remember when we won the card and just say, use the card and to defeat the search and Sir Larsar. Takari and Sir Vrak. Sir Uzerus. Sir Versary. He is a dog with extra heads and I cannot allow such an Adminatoin to stand. This you can see place where I dropped one rock. If don't do that I can't get past. See there is a purpose to my Mukinatoins. My Mukinatations. No one might climb the peaks of Mount Everest on the cliffs of a dangerous slope. It's very treacherous. I have to take my steps carefully and a slow journey on tech lifts, or I fall to the depths of a stranger barrier. Watch out! Watch you our step! Now! These steps try to knock me off, but no man can stop me! Not even a skeleton man! Or a guard! Or spider! Yippee! At the top here I claim my final piece of Aegis key, and what side I throw? Wouldn't you like to know? Actually probably nobody cares. Or do they? It's all part of the mystery. I solved the mystery with Professor Plum in the bathroom billiard parlor with a wrench through the source of passage. You've got a monopoly. With nine motels, a Baltic Avenue, a community tax, sucker. Like I said before, this is the greatest I've ever played in Decatana. I still think it's pretty good game, even with many flaws it doesn't deserve all the hazard. Maybe I will start a renaissance for Decatana. The four people that watch this video will be enlightened on the true glory of Decatana. Yes. For it I got Amathar level up. I think I will put this point into vitality to help me survive through Cerberus. Okay, now, Emery, I get the last part of Taki. The is key. Well, what a crock. Sully game, I uncover your sources and the day is mine. Oh, great, Mukiko the Sapper. This is bad when you lose them, they might be lost in the maze of a level up never to be found again. I have to go find you some hard to finish a level up, Mukiko, I miss you. Come back. Okay, thank god now I can continue. you. I'm forward to Super Cesar. The five-headed dude. Damn, this was a really long level. At least Grandma doesn't dies in this game. Like in the path. Poor Grandma. Listen, standing on the rook I dorked earlier. See, it's all necessary. I'm only doing the necessary press. Maybe someone else can go a let's play on hard difficulty where find all the secrets. Be my guest. I would like to see thousands of Decatana let's plays on the auction. It's my dark fantasy. Okay, Mukiki, let's go exit this level and get ready for the mini boss. Get ready! I can't leave for Sir Furios!